Welcome back to the track viewers where today we will have a very wild diecast monster truck race and as you can see our track is absolutely colored with colorful monster truck add-ons including barrels, crushed cars, and ramps. These are all the add-ons that come with the Spin Master monster trucks. Oh yeah, and let's not forget about the colorful driver add-ons that have gathered here near the starting gate for today's event. This is gonna be a wild one because today we have a color craze customs race. That's right, all the color craze trucks we have made will be doing battle today. Let's meet the first eight, starting with the red crustacean, blue blue thunder, the lime green Megalodon, the orange Bakugan, the white Gravedigger, the brown Horsepower, purple Jurassic Attack, and the teal mystery machines. These are some really cool looking color craze trucks and we know a lot of our viewers have followed the builds using parts from all these other trucks to make these color craze machines. And we know the dirt crew is going to be working some overtime here today because there is stuff all over this track. And if these die cast monster trucks don't stay in the racing lanes, there will be barrels, crushed cars, and ramps flying all over the place. I'm a little bit nervous about that colorful crowd over there by the starting line. I hope they're going to be okay throughout this race here today. But what do you say we take a minute now to meet the other eight trucks in this color craze tournament, starting with Green Dragon followed by Grey Earthshaker, Pink Monster Mutt Poodle, Green Jester, Burgundy Octonator, Yellow El Toro Loco, Black Soldier Fortune Black Ops, and the Light Blue Backwards Bob. Again, these are some really cool looking trucks. Find us on Facebook to let us know and comment on this video which trucks you think are your favorite and which trucks you think will win here today. But for now, let's take a look at today's racing bracket and how the races will lay out. And starting out for the tournament today, we will have Mystery Machine taking on Dragon, Jurassic Attack will face Earthshaker, Horsepower will be racing Poodle, Grave Digger will be going head to head with Jester, Bakugan Dragonoid will be facing Octonator, Megalodon will match up with El Toro Loco. Blue Thunder will face Black Ops. And finally, Crustacean will be racing backwards Bob. These color craze creations sure look good matched up here and ready to go racing. So what do you say we head up to the gates and get the races started? And up first, ready to go, we will have Mystery Machine in the black lane taking on Dragon. Let's go racing. Mystery Machine so fast coming down that first ramp. Look at that arrow. Dragon starts out Bob's big crash. Mystery Machine goes in the gray lane, crashes. Dragon flips over, lands on the wheels, and takes the win. Wow, look at all those barrels getting pushed. That was an awesome race. What happened to Mystery Machine? Let's take another look from the track cam. Mystery Machine so fast coming out of the gate, starts putting the power down, gets a little lead, huge jump, Dragon having problems. The Mystery Machine lands hard, crashes, Dragon lands on the wheels to take the win. Wow. That was wild, both trucks with huge flips here in that first round of racing, but Dragon lands on the wheels and takes the win, moving into the second round. First truck to move on, cool. Let's head up to the gates for the next pair now. And up next we have Jurassic Attack, taking on Earthshaker. It's time for some racing. Here we go, Jurassic Attack first coming into the jump, big flip from Jurassic Attack. Oh, lands on the wheels, but loses a lot of speed. Earthshaker passes for the win, wow. Bowling with the barrels at the end after the race. Let's take another look. Watch Jurassic attack in that black lane. Jumps, flips over, lands on the wheels, continues on, but it's too late because Earthshaker already passed for the win. Well, in that one, it was Earthshaker with a come from behind victory, taking the win to move into the next round. What a race. These obstacles on this track sure are throwing a little wrench in the works today. But let's head back up to the gates now where the next pair is lined up and ready to go. And up next, we will have the battle of horsepower taking on Poodle. Let's go racing. Green flag, here we go. Poodle a little ahead coming into that jump. Horsepower going way right. Oh, Poodle has a huge nose wheelie and a wheelie over the cars. Lands on the wheels after the line. Wow, what a race from Poodle. How did that truck stay on the wheels? Let's take another look. 
Watch the pink Poodle over there in that gray lane as they come down. Poodle so fast, getting a little lead. Big landing on the second jump. Nose wheelie flips, lands on the back. Wheelie over the cars for the win. Horsepower still makes it to the line, but not enough. If this were the freestyle round, I think Poodle would have racked up some serious points in that one. That was awesome. But Poodle still takes the win in this round, moving into the next race. Way to go, Poodle. Let's head back up to the gates now where the next pair is waiting for us to go. And up next, we have two awesome looking trucks with Grave Digger and Jester going head to head. Green flag and they're off side by side, coming into that first jump, big air, they're both going wide, they both wreck, coming back over the middle, they get together on the crush cars and Grave Digger takes the win, wow. What an even race from both trucks all the way up to the crush cars, that was wild. Let's take another look from the track cam, see what happened. As they come down the ramp, the trucks are side by side, coming off that first jump, they both go wide, both correct, and over the obstacles, in the center they get together, and Jester pushes Grave Digger for the win. Only halfway through the first round, and another wild race, with barrels flying everywhere after the finish line, and it is Grave Digger taking the win to move on, what a race. Let's head back up now for some more racing action. And for this matchup, we have Bakugan Dragonoid taking on Octonator. Let's go racing. Here we go, wheel to wheel once again, coming off that first jump. Good jump from both trucks. Off the second jump, they get together. Oh, Octonator spins backwards, pops it in reverse, and makes it to the line for the win. Wow, that's some awesome driving right there by Octonator. Sorry about that, Bakugan. Let's take another look from the track cam. This is a close race, coming down the ramp, off the first jump, smooth landing, even off the second jump, they get together, Octonator pops it in reverse there, check that out, bam, into the barrels for the win. That was some superb driving skills by that Octonator truck there at the last moment for the win. Octonator will move into the second round, what a race. I expect to see other good things out of that truck. Let's head back up to the gates now for the next one. And here we go now with Megalodon taking on El Toro Loco. Let's go racing. Green flag and they're off. Both trucks so fast coming down the ramp. Oh, where's El Toro Loco going off to the left? Wow. Megalodon with a big flip lands on the wheels to take the win. What happened to El Toro Loco? That's the first truck to go off the side into the ramps. Let's take another look and see. As the gate drops, both trucks so fast, but something must break in that El Toro Loco truck. It just goes straight left over into the ramps. Make it on with an awesome flip on the wheels for the win. El Toro Loco with a big crash into that field of jumps over there. Wow, allowing Megalodon to take the win and move on. What a race. Let's head back up to the gates now where the next pair is anxiously waiting. And up next, ready to race, we have Blue Thunder taking on Soldier Fortune Black Ops. Here we go. Both trucks wheel the wheel off that first jump. Big air, nice smooth landing for both trucks. They're even over the crush cars. Oh, Blue Thunder cuts off Black Ops and Black Ops powers by for the win. Wow, what just happened in that one? What happened to that Blue Thunder truck? Let's take a look from the track cam in slow-mo to find out. These trucks are even coming out of the starting gate off that first jump. Look at them, they're wheel to wheel, smooth landing. Thunder lands, starts going left, cuts off Black Ops. Black Ops takes the advantage and passes for the win. Blue Thunder tried to take out the opponent, but you don't become a Black Ops truck without having some tricks up your sleeve. Black Ops snuck by in that one for the win. What a race. That was awesome. Let's see what the next pair has in store now. And for this matchup, we have Crustacean taking on Backwards Bob. Let's go racing. Here we go, both trucks so fast, coming down the ramp, battling, oh, Crustacean lands, goes completely right. What happened to that truck? Backwards Bob so fast, still going in reverse all the way to the wall, knocking barrels down everywhere. What happened to that Crustacean truck over here against the wall? That was wild. Let's take another look. Coming down the ramp, they're wheel to wheel on this first jump. Crustacean lands, something breaks, just goes completely right into some crushed cars and barrels and backwards Bob takes the win. Crush Station over here is absolutely wedged between the wall, the jump, and the barrels. Wow. But I don't think it matters because Backwards Bob was so fast coming into that one with so much speed to take the win. What a race. What do you say we head over to the pits and check out the trucks that are moving on? With so many obstacles on the track getting blown all over the place after every round of racing, the dirt crew is definitely putting in some work here to get this track set up in between rounds. We really appreciate it, Dirt Crew. You're doing a great job. Thank you so much. Now, let's head over to the pits and check out the eight trucks that are moving on into the second round. There's been some great racing and it will continue. Starting with the Green Dragon and Pink Poodle. 
followed by the Grey Earthshaker and White Gravedigger. Then we have the Burgundy Octonator and Soldier Fortune Black Ops. Followed by the Lime Green Megalodon and Light Blue Backwards Bob. There's been some great racing here in the first round. Let's see what happens here in the second round. Let's go. And up first to the gates, we have Dragon taking on Poodle. Let's go racing. Here we go, Poodle so fast coming out of the gates. Dragon with problems coming off that first jump, hard landing, big crash. Poodle with the flip over the crush cars, wow. Dragon ends up in a wheelie, Poodle barely makes it to the line. What a race. Poodle will take the win, but wow, what a race that was. Let's take another look. Coming down the ramp, Poodle starts to pull away right out of the gate, but watch Dragon hardly makes the jump off there, lands hard, starts to crash, Poodle with the flip, Dragon lands in a wheelie, Poodle crashes to the line for the win. Well, I guess if you're not going to finish the race, one way to get the crowd going is to show off with the wheelie. Way to go, Dragon. But it is Poodle moving into the semi-final round by just barely crossing that line. What a wild event. Let's head back up to the gates now for the next one. And for this matchup, we have Earthshaker taking on Gravedigger. Let's go racing. Earthshaker so fast coming down that ramp. Gravedigger on the big problem over in the left lane. Wow, huge crash. Earthshaker flips over the crush cars for the win into the barrels. But what happened to Gravedigger? Is that crowd okay over there by the starting line? Let's see. Oh, wow, Gravedigger just barely missed the people. Let's take another look. Gravedigger coming down the ramp, watch him in that gray lane, just goes left, hits the obstacle, a huge flip over there right next to the people. Earthshaker takes the win, wow. We would like to start off by saying that no add-on action figures were harmed in the making of this video. And in that one, it's Earthshaker making it to the line first and moving into the next round. What a race that was. Let's head up to the gates now and see what the next pair has in store. Up next in the lanes, we have Octonator taking on Soldier Fortune Black Ops. Here we go. Gang drops and they're on Octonator about a half truck ahead coming off that first jump. Lands hard on the front end. Oh, Soldier Fortune hits the power, passes with a wheelie over the line for the win. Wow, what another come from behind victory for that Soldier Fortune Black Ops truck. Let's take another look. Coming out of the gates, Octonator starts to pull away about a half truck ahead. That's a hard landing on that second jump. Soldier Fortune takes advantage. Up over the crush cars in a wheelie for the win. Way to go. That's now two races in a row that Soldier Fortune takes the win with the come from behind victory. And this time it's to move into the semi-final round. What a race that was. But now back up at the starting line, there's another pair of trucks waiting to go, waiting on us. And here we go with Megalodon facing backwards Bob. Let's go racing. Green flag gate drops and they're off. Oh, coming down the first round, backwards Bob pushes Megalodon off the side of the track. Megalodon gets into all the jumps and crush cars can't make it. Backwards Bob backs across the line, taking out some barrels for the win. That's a new strategy there to win a race I haven't seen before. Just push the other truck off the track. Let's take another look. As they're coming down the ramp, watch backwards Bob over there in that gray lane. Maybe it's having problems, maybe it's intentional. Lands and just takes out Megalodon off the side as backwards Bob backs over the line for the win. What a race. Well, that's a cool looking lime green zombie Megalodon truck, but unfortunately it won't be moving on as backward Bob takes the win backwards to move into the semi-final round. What a race. Let's head over to the pit area now and check out the trucks moving into the semis. Thank you to all of our viewers that have stuck around this long in the race all the way into the semi-final round for our Hour Time for Adventures diecast monster truck racing. And we have already had 12 trucks eliminated from this tournament. These are still some great looking color craze trucks though. What do you think? Maybe you can get some parts and make some color craze of your own. But for now, let's meet the trucks moving on into the semi-finals. Starting with Pink Poodle and Black Soldier Fortune Black Ops followed by Gray Earthshaker and Blue Backwards Bob. All four of these custom-made color crazed monster trucks have had some great races here so far today, but which two trucks will make it into the final round and which truck will make it up here on this podium taking the win today? Let's head back up to the gates, get the races started to find out. And for this first matchup, we have the Pink Poodle taking on the Black Soldier Fortune Black Ops. Let's go racing. Pink Poodle so fast coming out of that gate. Look at that speed, huge jump. Black Ops has problems off the second jump and a big crash. Poodle so fast over the crush cars for the win. Wow, where did that power come from in that Poodle truck? And what happened to Black Ops? Let's take another look from the track cam and find out. 
Watch how much speed that Poodle truck has on the left side of your screen, coming down the ramp, into the jump so fast, about a truck length ahead, huge jump, but Soldier Fortune has problems off the second jump, crashes, and Poodle takes the win. That Black Black Ops truck had two come from behind victories here so far today, but it didn't work in that race as Poodle takes the win and will move into the final round. Black Ops will have to race one more time for third place. Now let's head back up to the gates for the next pair. And with this matchup, we have Backwards Bob taking on Earthshaker. Let's go racing. Gate drops and raw. Earthshaker ahead coming into that first jump and has huge air lands on the lip of the second jump, slows up. Backwards Bob flips, lands on the wheel, passes and will make it to the line for the win. Wow, Earthshaker gave away the win by jumping too far. That truck just had too much power. Let's take another look. Here we go as the gate drops. Watch Earthshaker in that gray lane. I know it's hard to see, it blends in, but huge jump lands on the lip. Flip slows up, backwards spot lands on the wheels, powers out to the line for the win. What a race. That was another awesome come from behind victory here in the color craze race as backwards Bob passes Earthshaker to take the win moving into the final round and Earthshaker will race one more time for that third place podium spot. Which trucks do you think will get it? Let's head over to the pits one more time and check out the trucks in the finals. And it was the Dirt Crew once again getting this track ready for the final round. This has been a great tournament here so far and let's find out who the winners are. Starting with your battle for third place, we have Black Soldier Fortune Black Ops taking on Grey Earthshaker. And for your final round, it's a colorful one because we have Pink Monster Mutt Poodle taking on Light Blue Backwards Bob. Which of these two trucks will win the Color Craze race here today? Let's head up to the gates, get the races started and find out now. Here we go with your race for third place. We have the Black Soldier Fortune Black Ops in the black lane and the Gray Earthshaker racing out of the gray lane. Which trucks are gonna be on the podium? Let's go racing. Here we go, Earthshaker way ahead, coming into that first jump off a smooth landing for Soldier Fortune Black Ops, powers off the second jump, catching up, they both their bumps over the crush cars and whoa, at the line, which truck was it? It was so close. We're definitely gonna have to take a look at the track cam for this one in slow motion. Watch him as the gate drops, Earthshaker starts to pull away by about a truck length coming into the first jump and so Fortune lands smoother, powers off and at the line it is Earthshaker by a tire tread, would you look at that for the final round, it's a photo finish, what a race. You just witnessed an awesome race right there, viewers. I don't know if we've ever had a closer race for third place in that final podium spot. And it is Earthshaker making it to the line by a tire tread. Black Ops almost had it, but Earthshaker's moving on. Now let's head up to the gates for the race everyone's been waiting for. And here it is, the final race for the Color Craze Championship here on this colorful track. Which truck will it be? Will we have the pink poodle taking home the win or will it be blue backwards Bob? Let's go racing. Green flag, here we go. Poodle pulling ahead, coming down into that first jump. Oh, backwards, Bob has a problem off the jump, doesn't clear the second obstacle. Poodle will take an easy win, taking out all those barrels after the finish line. Wow, backwards, Bob just gave that one away. Let's see again what happened to that truck. Watch backwards, Bob over in that gray lane as the gate drops. That truck slows up, coming into the jump, loses power, can't clear the jump, and Poodle flies across the crush cars, taking out some barrels for the win. Wow. Well, I guess it would be pretty hard to drive a monster truck when you're driving it backwards, but it's too bad that truck wrecked. That truck's been great here all day, but it is Pink Poodle, smoother in the final round to take the win and the overall championship here in this color craze race. What do you say we head up on over to the winner's circle and check them out? Here we are, one last look at this colorful track. We have all the add-ons out and they've been great. And we can't say thank you enough to this dirt crew here today for keeping the track in line in between rounds. They have done absolutely incredible. And before we take a look at the winners, let's take one more look at the Color Craze trucks. Here are the Color Craze trucks in our collection. These trucks have been great to build and you can build your own at home using parts from multiple trucks. We'd love to see them. And for today's race, here are your top three. These trucks have been great here all day and so fast in this tournament. They definitely deserve to be up there. And in third place, up on that bronze podium, we have the Gray Earthshaker. In second place, up there on that silver podium today, we have that bright blue backwards Bob truck. Check out that truck, it is so great in all blue. What do you think? 
and your champion here today for our first color craze tournament we have the all pink monster mud poodle this truck is incredible and so fast here today we love seeing these trucks up here on these podiums now what do you say we take a minute and help all three of these trucks celebrate their wins here today Thanks again for watching Our Time for Adventures. Until next time.